has more from the studio. Now you've likely already seen her picture and can easily tell Renee Benjamin's smile is contagious. Her partner says she smiled from the inside out, something that not only was taken away from her, but from the world. It's a smile seen often in Dominique Woods' photos. If you've ever seen somebody smile from the inside out, the inside, she was an inside out person. A smile lost after a gunman entered XL Industries and opened fire. And I picked up my phone and I just started calling her like, what's going on? I need to hear from you. I need to hear from you. But Renee Benjamin didn't answer. I went to every hospital. I was looking for her. And she wasn't there and I just knew it. <laughs> I knew something else was wrong. It wasn't until a 3 a.m. phone call from a chaplain that Dominique knew her fears were a reality. And I don't think that people understand how it feels to have somebody ripped away from you that you, you don't even get to say goodbye. Now Dominique is clinging to her memories. She was dedicated to Excel. She loved that job. She loved the people. A love, a smile, a life that will live on through Renee's legacy. I love her for the strength that she gave me, and I don't know where it is now. I can't, I'm not strong right now. Like many of the victims' loved ones, Dominique was at one of last night's vigils. She said even though Renee was a quiet person and would never want to be the center of attention, she wanted to make sure her story, her life, was shared.